Morning everybody. I'm going to do the mini makeup challenge. I saw Lacey Morris Beauty do this. I saw Fat Fit Mama do this. And I saw a lot of other people do this. So, I have all my minis that I've collected from my Sample Saturday series. And... We're going to put it on my face. <laughs> um, problem is, I have a gel. Tarte gel skin tint. That will be my blush. Um, but I have a powder foundation. So I'm putting the gel tint on my skin first. And we're going to see how this works out. I'm not going anywhere today. I'm just doing this for the benefit of using product. Okay. I forgot. I have a mirror. Yeah. That is really red. I hope that foundation puts that down some. Okay. <laughs> and I have a tart, not tart. I have Boxy Charms cream highlighter that they gave us. I don't like that the boxes are making their own products because we don't know who's making those products. I would rather they go to Tarte or to ColourPop or Wet n Wild. Well, maybe not Wet n Wild, <laughs> but uh, uh, pe um, companies that are already making them that are well known and uh, that we know. Instead of making their own. Because we're not paying for their stuff. We're paying for um, Bella Pierre. We're paying for Tarte. We're paying for all, every, all, all the others. Jeffree Star, wouldn't that be nice? Um, that's what we're paying. That's what we want. We don't want their name brand on a generic product. Okay. This is the L'Oreal Primer for your eyelashes. Voluminous primer that I pulled. I pulled this like three weeks ago. This stuff is awesome. This is when I first started putting mascara back on my eyes. But it really does lengthen your lashes. I like. I don't think that this causes flaking either. By the way, I've already curled my lashes. Did that before. Um, I don't think this causes flaking or anything because I use this with two different mascaras. I used it with the Marcel Black Mascara. And I used it with a CoverGirl Flourish Mascara. And it does not flake with the CoverGirl. I've had flaking with this. But I'm still very thankful for this. I did not pull this in my sample Saturday series. Stephanie from Random Reviews with Stephanie gave this to me in friend mail. She freaked me out. So, she sent me a big old box of stuff. So, thank you, Stephanie. So, I'm using this. I still like it, though. 
I actually feel like I have eyelashes. And I'll show you why. I've been, I think I used mascara four times this week. So today I'll be five. I don't always put it on. Okay. Look at those. I got lashes. I'm excited. Okay. I did that. Okay. So here's the wet and wild. I just took the little thing off. This is the wet and wild. Hold on. It, it's like this. The Wet n Wild Foundation. This is, and I grabbed it this morning in my sample series. Wet n Wild's Natural Blend. That's a sample size, right? That's a tiny amount of product. But uh, I just took the safety sale off. So this is my foundation. Oh look, nothing came out. There it goes. I'm trying. Not a whole lot came out. Maybe I should put it in here. That was a mistake. I think there's too much in here. It's packed too tight. And I can't get it out. Is there a difference? I just put it right over. Give me one second. We're going to take this little thing off. Okay. Now I got some. This might be too much. <laughs> Look what I did. Okay. Oh, yeah. Much better. This is a sample because this will not last me long like this. Put a lot of that stain on my face. I can still see the stain. I kind of like that. But this was useless. Okay. Putting this over here. I got my eyes on. 
I got the foundation. I haven't done this yet. This is the Tarte List um, by Tarte. It's a uh, brow gel. And it has no color. It's clear. I do like the push my brows up. There's really not hardly anything left in this. I did that. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. This is the Take Home the Bronze um, in the color Olive by The Bomb. Okay. Here we go. Okay, gonna put on some eyeshadow. This is, who is this? I forget. Oh, Laura Mercier. And it's in the golden rose, or gold rose color. It really... Just puts a shine to my eyelash, my uh, lids. All right, two things off to do. One, the Bella Pierre Cosmetics HD Finish Powder. There is some already in here, so I don't have to shake it. I have two sets of brushes that I use. I cleaned one set yesterday, and I realized that I had already cleaned those brushes. <laughs> so, and they're still wet. So, I did it last night when I was freaking out still. Dun, 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 dun. It's a very light makeup for me. I don't have a whole lot of makeup to put on with this. But maybe as I get more makeup in my from my pro, my Saturday sample series, I'll just keep doing this and adding to it. And you know, then you'll be like, "Girl, stop putting the makeup on." Okay, this is melted Mac and Queen B. This is what I pulled this morning and I still have not used it. So, let's put it on. Hold on. It matches my lips pretty much. I like it.
it's definitely going to be mad. I can feel it happening right now. Okay, you guys, that's pretty much it. I have... This is my hair. My hair turned out pretty good. I used the... Uh, one of the dry shampoos. And it's laying nicely, thank you. This is... What is this? I pulled this before. Oh. Winky Lux. Another lip gloss. Well, it's a lip gloss. Um, it doesn't leave any color on your skin, real on your lips, but it takes. Well, it, well, it smells like uh, frosting. It's really nice, and uh, I'm gonna put it on to make my lips a little shiny. Okay. Apparently. Okay, that's better. There. Alright, you guys. What do you think? This was the tiny makeup challenge I did. I did. did I do okay? You can tell me if you don't like it. But I'm going to be using this all week. This. As my new foundation. I'll still use this as my bronzer because I don't have a bronzer. And I'll use the mascara and everything until it's gone. Okay. I don't think it turned out bad. What do you think? You think I did okay? Okay. All right. You guys, you have a good day. I'm going to let you go.